It's Nina Compton, everybody. Remember I met her and her husband Larry at the Red Beans and Rice, and now I get to try her food. She's one of Food & Wine Magazine's best new chefs, and she's just been nominated for a James Beard Award. And Compare Le Pen is her spectacular restaurant. Larry, how are you? <laughs> here I am. Good to see you. I'm very excited to be here. Well, we're happy to have you. Compare Le Pen. Oh, hey! my friend. Hey! You, Abigail Good Phil. To see you again, my love. Phil how Abigail. Are you? And here's how small Nola is. I met this lovely bartender, Abigail, while I was stuffing my face at Turkey and the Wolf. That, this is a beautiful bar. Isn't it a gorgeous bar? With beautiful people. Look at the people. Ah! We got birthday girls over here. If someone in New Orleans is having a birthday, they pin money on them. No matter how hard you go, at least you'll have cab fare when you get home. Oh, Make sure she gets home, young man. <laughs> oh, he's actually, he is taking me home. <laughs> hey, this is a family show. Now, I heard you like tequila. Well, we have two tequila cocktails right now on the menu. I don't want to taste both. Oh, let's do both then. I love it. Right? Delicious. I might finish That's both good. of these. Yeah. That's good. That's good. But just as I'm about to forget why I'm really here. Hello, chef. How are you? Oh, good to see you. How are you? Good. How's everything? I'm in love with Abigail. Yeah. <laughs> these are two of the better drinks I've ever had. Okay. They're fantastic. Chef, can I get you something to drink? Surprises. All right. Really? You just had surprises? Oh, yeah, yeah, oh, yeah. By the way, that's what I said yeah, to her. Yeah. <laughs> And she didn't disappoint. The delicious surprises continue as Nina makes me a dish inspired by her upbringing on the Caribbean Isle of St. Lucia, her spectacular curried goat. So it's not your traditional curry goat. I make a sweet potato gnocchi and toasted cashews and cilantro on top. So it's not that straightforward. Goat is special, right? I mean, it's just incredible. You know, it's one of those things that I wanted to put on the menu because it's something that I grew up with in my childhood. It's my comfort food. And I thought to myself, I'm like, are people really gonna understand this dish or order it? Number one selling dish. It beats chicken, it beats steak, it beats everything else. Yeah. Nina, this is gonna be like world famous, this dish. <laughs> ordering one goat, we're ordering like six or seven goat a week. You said you had to go far to get these, right? You we're have getting, to... we're getting from Mississippi. You can't, you can't like raise them a little closer? We're trying, we're trying. I think you put your trash out back <laughs> and you just have goats out there. <laughs> That'll be an easy fix, right? Yeah, exactly. Well, cheers. Bless you, this is amazing. 